Hey guys, on to today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to update your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch to iOS 9.3.3. Now, uh, fair warning for those of you who have an iPad and use iBooks, I would skip this update, okay? Just wait for the next one over. It's probably going to be iOS 10, but who knows? Apple could be coming over with iOS 9.3.4 to fix that iBooks issue. So do skip this over just in case if you have an iPad. For iPhones, I haven't heard that many problems with iBooks, but if you do use iBooks, just skip this for now. It's not a big deal, small update. So right now you guys are gonna go into settings. Under settings, just scroll down, it says general right there. And you guys want to go and tap on software update. Under software update, we should see iOS 9.3.3. From there, just put download and install. So I'm gonna tap that because I know nothing's gonna happen. Put your in your password. If you don't have one, you don't have to. After doing that, it's gonna start downloading, okay? So just press agree right here on the right hand side. Okay, so again, agree. And it's gonna download. So for this, I would always suggest having whatever you have, an iPad, iPad, iPod Touch, always connected to your computer or electricity somehow, okay? To your wall charger, whatever you guys have to charge your phone, iPad, iPod Touch, have it hooked up, okay? Although you're just downloading right now and you're gonna install it a little bit later, it's always pretty important to have it at least 50% of the battery. If it dies, and it, it's installing that's a big problem if it dies when it's downloading it doesn't really matter okay you guys can always download it again but if it dies when it's installing the os then you guys are gonna have to restore so always always make your backup even when everything goes fine uh glitches do happen so it's always good to go into your iCloud and make that backup so manually go to backup now and tap there okay so do that first if you guys have no more space on your iCloud, don't worry. You guys have pretty much unlimited space as long as you connect it to your computer and make your backup there, okay? So you can make your backup using iTunes, whether you have a PC or Mac, iTunes is free for both. And you guys can make your backup right there. So make sure to do that. This is a small update. So usually with bigger updates, so when iOS 10 comes out, I would highly, highly suggest making a uh, backup on your iTunes. But right now, it's no big deal. This is 9.3.3, which is not a huge update, so don't worry about it. Just make your backup if you have enough space on your iCloud, okay? Um, that's it for this tutorial. If you guys have any comments, questions, you can write them down here below in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.